Hey guys, whiskey review time. Tonight, we got Parker's Heritage 10 year heavy char. This year's release, 2020. She comes in at 120 proof and been aged in barrels 10 years. I like a little oak in my bourbon, that's just me. Uh, I take it neat as well. Add water or on ice, however you guys take it. Let's give it a little, uh, little test drive. All right, guys, let's get to this. Wow. First thing I notice on the nose, fruit, deep, rich, cherry, a little bit of like mahogany and oak and vanilla. A little bit of orange in there. So far, so good. I'm liking the nose. Got a little bit of legs on her. You can see that or not. Nice viscosity. Viscosity, excuse me. All right, first sip. It's definitely rich and sweet. First two things I think of. Rich, sweet, after dinner pour. In comes the cherry, some of that vanilla, some of that heat punching through. Oh yeah, oh yeah. A little bit of chocolate, some tannin, nothing crazy, nothing that just would turn you off. Um, all right, do this and then uh, we'll score. Let's talk about the finish a little. This is a great bourbon. She enters in, full body, rich. On the back end, I get orange marmalade, almost like a gingerbread, and some baking spices, like you're in a bakery and you smell some something being made. Maybe like bread or maybe cookies being made, something like that. That's what I'm thinking of when I say that. A little bit of that oak, a little bit of tobacco on the back. The heat dies off. It definitely drinks at 120 for sure. Uh, yeah, I think it's a great bourbon for $250. I don't think so. But, I mean, for a fair review, for a fair price, 150 sure. I, I mean even 200. I am a little biased when it comes to price because I like good bourbon. Some people won't spend that. And that, that's cool. You do you. Um, I've, I've always liked the Parker's line for the most part. They usually put out really good product. Uh, so with that being said, I'm going to score this one out of 10. And I'm going to give this, I'm going to give this a solid 7.5. Yeah. Definitely, like if it's in 7.5 and above, pretty good in my book. So uh, that's the review. Parker's Heritage, 10-year, heavy char. If you find it, buy it, open it, and drink it. It's good shit.